Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 It's time to talk about how to fix iPhone touchscreen unresponsive after iOS 17 software update. Recently, many users have complained that their iPhone touchscreen has become unresponsive after iOS 17 software update. If you're also dealing with a frozen touchscreen and are wondering how to fix it, you have arrived at the right spot. That said, let's get started. First and foremost, I would recommend you how to reset your iPhone since it has long been a highly effective solution for fixing frozen screen or the annoying iOS issues. To do so, press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button, then you have to hold down the side button or the power button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Once your iPhone has restarted, check if the touchscreen has started to work normally. If it has, you have gotten the better of the issue. Next up, I would suggest you remove the screen guard. Some cheap screen guards tend to become unresponsive when they get old. Therefore, remove the screen guard and check if the display works normally. If it does, your screen protector is at fault. Finally, I would recommend you restore your iPhone. Keep in mind that this is a radical solution which you should try only when the basic tips don't work for you. It is also worth pointing out that it will completely erase your iPhone. Therefore, make sure to fully back up your device before going for the kill. To get started, connect your iPhone to your Mac or Windows PC using a USB cable. After that, launch iTunes or Finder. Then select your iPhone in the sidebar. Next up, click on Backup Now to fully back up your device. And once your device has been successfully backed up, click on Restore iPhone to erase the device and install the latest available software. Next up, set up your iPhone from scratch and restore the device from the latest backup. And that's pretty much it. So, these are the best tips and tricks to fix iPhone touchscreen unresponsive after iOS 17 software update. Hopefully, you have gotten the better at the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it. And I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.